God lives and works today. He is building a kingdom for His children out of a very precious material. It is called faith. Today's meditation by Basilea Schlink shares what happened when the sisters from the little land of Canaan tried to use this material, faith, to build a chapel. O oh, faith brings God's almighty power to men so weak and lowly. When tempted, victory will share if we but trust God wholly. For nothing can our way oppose. Even iron doors will give to those who trust in God Almighty. After our sisterhood was founded in 1947, with our own hands we started to build a chapel and a mother house. It was a time of great poverty when no one had anything. The song which the choir just sang came into existence during this time. At one point we had used up our entire supply of stones, and it seemed that we couldn't go on with the construction. We had been allowed to take building materials from the bombed-out ruins of Darmstadt, but now we couldn't find any more, and we had no money to buy more stones. What should we do? We had to believe and pray in faith. For several days the whole sisterhood prayed that God would show his power by providing the materials in some way. Then, at just the right moment, help came, in the form of a telephone call from an architect we knew. He had watched the sisters at work on the building and had suggested to the city council that we be allowed to take what we needed from the ruins of some barracks. Our father had heard our request. Now we could continue to build our chapel to His glory. As we can see from this story, the Lord gives us many possibilities to build up our faith. There is no one in the world who doesn't need something. But the person who believes in Christ need never be depressed because he is lacking something. God will use these very needs to kindle our faith, to make true His promise as found in Mark 11.24. Therefore I tell you, whatever you ask in prayer, believe that you will receive it, and you will. Shouldn't this promise encourage us and fill our hearts with joyful expectation whenever we lack something? Yes, how great and wide are the possibilities of faith. In whatever situation of need we may find ourselves, faith can triumph. However, when our Heavenly Father doesn't answer right away, we must endure in believing. His timing is not always our timing. Therefore, begin to bring Him your needs. Trust Him in childlike faith. He will hear and answer your requests. The trusting soul inherits all The heavenly kingdom's riches The Father's hands let blessings fall all want and deed he changes, though we be told all things you lack. In joyous face we answer back, we trust in God Almighty. You have been listening to a program written by Basileus Schlink of the Little Land of Canaan. To learn more about how God lives and works today, visit us at our website, www.canaan.org. That's K A N A A N.org. If you contact us, we would be happy to send you a free inspirational booklet. If you do not have access to the web, please contact this radio station for our postal address. God bless you.